no, they're not keying on Andrew. I mean, it's just um, uh, Xavius is, is a good football player too, and he's been in position to make some plays, and he's made made some nice plays for us. Oh, I think he's got good size, and and he's a good athlete, runs real well, lanky, and he's he's got a lot of game experience, and he, and he plays fast. He has good good speed for a big kid. Well, you know they they run a lot of the read option and and some of the some of the other runs that go on with a mobile quarterback. Um, so we got to stop the run. We got to do a better job with that than we have in the last last two weeks. And uh, then when when they do throw it, he's mobile. He he can extend plays and he's accurate and he he's he's much improved football player. He's he do, he's doing a heck of a job. We got our work cut out for him because uh, he can run and he can throw the ball pretty well. They're up to my name with a lot of sacks last year. Where is your biggest advantage on the front? Well, you know, I, hopefully, um, you know, our advantage. Well, I don't know that yet. You know, we'll, we'll have to wait and see and how the how the game unfolds. I, I'm, you know, we haven't done a great job up front as of now. You know, last week it was we got pushed around. So this is this is. This is a game where we got to bounce back and show what we can really do. So I don't really know if we have an advantage up to, up to this point oh, over those guys. I mean, it's it's it remains to be seen. We we need more production out of our defensive line and 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 our, our linebackers as well. Um, I think some guys are getting better. We're getting the freshmen, some of the young guys, more reps, and and they're starting to get it and starting to play real real fast or faster, I should say. So I, I see the young guys improving, yeah. And, um, you know, some of the guys uh, that, uh, that have played a little bit more, they're, they're, they're progressing. But I see a little more, more uh, improvement with some of the newer kids. Does the South House quarterback compare uh, well to Whitlow compared to two weeks ago? Yeah, I think he's mobile like Whitlow. And, and maybe they, they have a lot more quarterback runs. South Alabama does than than some of the other schools that we've played. So, you know, he's 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 a good good football player, and he's, he started off the season playing really well. So they have, I think, more gun runs, you know, more quarterback type runs for him in their offense than some of the other schools that we've played. So that he's featured more. I I I think there's been some some. Uh, some good leadership there. I think that's something we're we're trying to improve on every day. We need to be we, we need to be more vocal out there with our older kids, and, and it's it's you know that's something that 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 is an ongoing process. So we, we need to improve in that area. How much of your game plan has been focused on their backup quarterback, who also has a rushing touchdown and a long run? You know what they they do the same plays really with with either guy. So the game plan doesn't change much. Uh, between the two quarterbacks, There's, they still run the same plays uh, uh, with either quarterback. So it, it not that big a difference at all.